Um, and once we've got a bit more money, I am definitely going to move into some uh, getting some olive oil on the go, so this can upgrade even more. Alright, so this is downgrading. Why? Needs more clean water from a fountain. Alright, well we've got, like I say, we've got the... Uh, Alright, good. So they move straight back. These homeless people will actually move straight back into their old house as soon as they realise, oh, there totally is room. <laughs> Alright, so it looks like these places are just a little short on fleece. Maybe even just another Agora there. I'm not sure if that's a bright move or not. We do look like we're doing A-OK -okay for food and fleece. I mean, more than A-OK -okay for fleece. What do these guys need? More culture. Oh, something's collapsed. Oh, that was really dumb. Oh, and that means we can't collect tax. And I think that was quite expensive. Oh, it really was. That was not my brightest move. All right. Um, we'll unpause so that disappears. So we can replace it. And then what we're going to do is... No, not a tax office. We're going to stick a guy there. Now we are so short on money now. We are really going to have to wait. Hopefully, ah, there we go. So these guys should upgrade. So now, almost everyone. This guy's got another. No, they're not quite enough, is it? Um, we may move this later when we have a bit more money again. But I think for now, let's stick a drama school up here. Just to spit out a few more culture people. So they should go wandering. Hopefully they'll go wandering down this way and provide a nice amount of culture. We can expand out this way and out this way, so that's good. Um, this is just a very sort of rough... Hygiene is no longer perfect. Unemployment prevents... Okay, yeah, so... We're making a bit more money. People are... Ooh, we definitely want another granary because we don't want to be in a position where we don't have enough food. Um, and then... We are now in a position where we can afford to start getting some olives on the go. So what we're going to do with that is... Move that down there. And then we're going to get a couple of growers lodges on the go. I will fill that one in once the sheep go. And we're going to get some olive trees. Again, it can only be placed on a meadow. But we're going to stick this just there. I think that seems like a decent little patch of olives. Um, and actually, this guy... No, it wasn't this guy, was it? It was this guy. I no longer want them to accept fleece. And uh, what I actually want them to do is go get olives. So all the olives can go there. And... Then we will build a few olive presses and build that. Uh, may as well be near the. Yeah, may as well be there. Again, we may rearrange this to make it a little prettier later, but for now, this is probably going to do the job. Um. Ooh, what was I going to do? I was going to build another storehouse because we're going to need somewhere to store all of these all of these olives. And this guy is going to go and get olive oil. So all the fleece and the olive oil will be nice and close to the Agora. Alright, so that's downgrading. But it's also immediately re-upgrading. I think it was a culture thing. They were short on culture. Alright. So we're nice and stocked up on food. As you can see, the olive guys are going out to tend the olive branches, so they'll get olives on the go. Um, they'll be stored there. They will then go to the olive presses. Oh, actually, I can... Oh, man, we are so unemployed. We're going to need to do something about that, but money is so tight right now that I can't afford a whole lot more industry. Um, uh, Grower's Lodge. Yeah, so that should be enough for that. Uh... Okay, so we've actually mm, smashed through our cap there. Food may be an issue at some point in terms of just the sheer number of people that we 
need to feed. We are starting to reach our limit with that, um, but for now we're okay. For now we're just okay. Until olive oil. Okay, we've got a fire. That is a big problem. Um, I don't want to have to do this, but we'll stick another maintenance guy there because they will immediately go and put that out. Yeah, there's a guy coming there with water. Alright, so he got to it in time, so that's fine. Oh man, fleeces. That's actually a very good point. Uh, not that I said anything there, but I was thinking something. Um, we're going to trade. Now, we have a lot of fleece. More fleece than we need. So for now, we can s start trading it. Does anyone need fleece? No. <laughs> Nobody needs fleece. That's Oh, actually, Libya? Libya. Libya. Of course, Libya. All right, so what we're going to do is... If I can remember where the trading section is... We're going to build a pier to Libya, so it has to be built near water, so we'll build that, um, we'll also stick another maintenance guy, you can never really have too many maintenance guys, um, and what we will do is we will sell fleece, now you can limit it, so I don't want us to sell more than 16 fleece at a time, because I want to make a little bit of money, but I don't want, to, I don't want us to be short, that would be terrifying, so now what these guys should do, he's going to go off and get some excess fleece, Ah, there we go. So, as I said, sometimes they will just randomly give you wine. So, extra wine. Um, while we're here, let's build an extra storehouse that will go and get all of the wine and actually won't accept anything else. That is just going to be for the wine that we need for Hercules. Because apparently the guy needs 32 jugs of it. A little bit of an alcohol problem, if you ask me. So, as you can see, we are selling fleece. We've got 44 fleece at the moment. Um... Still doesn't have excellent cultural access. I think what we may need to do to achieve that is... Let's start with building a gymnasium along here. And then also... I may link this up at some point. But not right now. Let's also build a college and a drama school. And what that should do is force people to walk past Hercules' thing. So hopefully that will pop up. So then all we really will need is to up... We'll get another gift at some point. We'll need to up the cultural access and we'll need to win a Panhellenic game. Um, which we're doing alright at. We may stand a chance of. Um, we've got good access but not excellent. Um, okay, now it's excellent. Now that the... There's actually games going on here. There is excellent coverage. And all of these guys will flood up here and also help boost the culture in these sections as well. So that's fantastic. We've got housing for 200 more, four more people. We are running a little, little, little bit low. All right, so we are selling fleece. So that's great. Um, I don't know if they'll have appeared yet, but they do. You can actually see the, uh, the traders. I don't think they have just yet. That's okay. Um, you'll actually see them float up, come and take it, so that's quite cool. We've still got a lot of unemployment, I really need to sort that out. Um, what's a good thing to do? No, we don't really need that. Uh, food. We definitely need to work on our food industry. Definitely, definitely, definitely. So let's spread out here. Let's build a few more dairies. Which will mean that we can build a few more goats. <laughs> build a few more goats. Okay, so I have to wait for them to be... Yeah, okay, so they are now... Alright. Keeping an eye on our drachma there. Okay, so that's gone way up, so that's good. Unemployment is still a problem. Could lower the wage rate. Will that affect this? Yeah, it will. You don't pay them at all. How much will that? What will that do for happiness? It has gone up, but unrest is still none. I'll keep an eye on that because obviously I haven't got any policemen, so that could be an issue. 
but um, I think we'll be okay for now. But I will have to keep an eye on that. Make sure popularity doesn't dip too much. Make sure unrest doesn't come up. But right now, we are... Okay, popularity has gone down. Alright, so having no wages is not a good idea. <laughs> not a good idea. Um, we are just about making more money. Um, Alright, so we'll up that to low. Yeah, we'll up that to low. Hopefully that should go back up. We may have to wait for a month to tick by before it sort of upgrades itself. Okay, so the Impian games have begun. Um, I don't think we have much of a chance of winning those, do we? Like, popularity is still poor, but that's okay. We have a not bad chance, so basically, no, we're not going to win the Olympian Games. Alright, what's going on here? They've run out of fleece. I may want to move... Oh, this is not good. What is this? Uh, yeah, it's a fleece issue. We have enough of... <clears throat> excuse me, we have enough of it. Okay, so he came right around. I'm not liking that. We're going to have to do something about that, I think. I think what we'll do is we will... We'll clear out these three. And then we'll delete some Boulevard there. We'll stick another Agora there. And that is just going to be a fleece vendor for now. For now, that will just be a fleece vendor. Um... And we'll fill this bit in with park because that'll make things a little prettier and a little prettier. Now, I'm hopeful. Oh, what happened there? Oh, of course. Of course, I'm a fool. I'm an absolute fool. Now, can I... Can't make that into boulevard, can I? That's okay. These guys can go, there's still some park there. These guys can go straight back there. That's not going to be a problem. You already have too many workers. Yeah, I know, but all right. So hopefully those homeless people will come back. If not, more people will move in. So it's not really the end of the world. Um, I do also want to fill this bit in with park though, just to keep the prettiness level up. So that fleece guy, think is from here yes he is so now this dude should immediately start wandering around if we've got enough yeah we've got enough screw it man I'm gonna put another I'm gonna put a food guy and an oil guy in there as well curious to see how olive oil is getting on um, all right so it's a yearly thing with olives obviously because they need to ripen so it doesn't look like the olive have actually happened yet. Oh wow, so money is actually going really well now. We still got a lot of unemployed. Um, so you know what, we will spend that on some more culture because we do need to do that. So let's drag this down here. Let's go another two colleges. Podiums. Another couple of drama schools. And you know what? Let's go with a theater as well. Actually, let's go with another couple of gym, another gymnasium. I've not done very well with that. Let's undo that one, actually. Can I undo that? Yes, I can. Oh, I don't know how many things I just undid. Nope. Okay, that's fine. Um, all right, so we've actually got a good chance in a lot now, but drama is still looking a bit dodgy. So let's go with another theatre there, maybe? No, it doesn't need another one. We'll go for another drama school rather than another theatre. Just to really... Drama is still okay. Why is drama okay? Ah, city coverage, I see. So the theatre probably isn't in a great place there, but what we can do is place a theatre. Let's place a theatre here for now. Probably not needed. Alright, so that's actually moved up to not bad. Oh, great, Psyduck Mantis. News abound. Our city's contestants won the Olympian Games. Okay, so we won the big one. Like, we didn't win, like, the Euros. We won the World Cup. We have just nailed it. Alright, so we won a Panhellenic game. That's fantastic. Hercules, how are we doing? 
Alright, all we need is another 16, which they will offer us. What are you guys? Wage? You call that a wage? Okay. I've had enough of you and your city. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Alright, my popularity has actually gone way down, so we'll leave the wage rate on normal. Because people are getting... Unrest is still none, but people are getting a bit sketchy. What we need is olive oil. But that should be on its way pretty soon. I am so smart. So very, very smart. I won the game. <laughs> I won the games! I'd like to thank my teachers at the drama school, the muses, and all the little people that made this possible. Everyone bow down before me! <laughs> I won the game! I am the strongest man in all Greece! Probably even stronger than Hercules! Okay, so they're a little bit jazzed that they won the games. Which I suppose if you won the Olympic Games, you would be too. So I can't really blame them for that. Oh, something's just happened. Alright, so a wolf has attacked a goat. Um, you know what? We are making money now. So I think what I'm going to do is just wall these guys off. I sh didn't really need to do it like that, actually. It's maybe a little ugly. But that'll keep them in. Yeah. That was a little bit of a waste of money, but I'm not trying to min-max this. That'll just keep the walls at bay, except for this guy. Um, actually, that's a good point. Can we... How do we place them? At home? Muster company. Okay, no. It's not right-click. Um, master company. Okay, if I right click this, will it help me out? No. Hmm, I don't remember the uh, the controls for that one. Um, go to company. Master company. No, right clicking just cancels it. I thought it was just click to place, but. Master company over there, no? Shift, maybe? Maybe it's because it's paused? Ah, it's because it's paused, that's why. Alright, so what we'll do is hit master. As you can see, here they come. They are literally just, uh... I'm bored. How much longer do I have to stand here? <laughs> Alright, so if we stick them over there, if we get them on... Okay, yeah, cool. So they've dealt with that wolf. Job done. Now you can send them home, they'll go back to the workforce, and then we'll stick that one back in there. And that's job done. Okay, so apparently... Oh, God. Uh, I should probably deal with this. Oh, you know what? This was a bad idea. Right at the, prob right at the beginning, this was a bad idea. So what I'm going to do is just... I hope no animal rights people are watching because I'm just going to have to kill these wolves. They're just going to cause me a problem. So, um, let's go offensive tactics. So, yeah, just kill the wolves, please. There we go. So, they'll just eliminate this issue. I actually feel kind of bad because wolves are kind of adorable, but can't have them killing my goats. I had to pay for those goats. Alright, um, let's see. We could build some more carding sheds. We are selling fleece, so if we built like an absolute ton of it, it might not be a bad idea. We've got clearly got enough. Um, yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to build some more carding sheds, build some more sheep, <laughs> place some more sheep, and uh, use that. Alright, so we'll place some more sheep. Have to place them on a meadow, that's not a problem. Alright. And we'll actually sell a little bit more fleece now. Let's sell 32 at a time. High unemployment is a problem. Yeah, I can see that, but... And it's only going to get worse once... Uh... My popularity is poor. I'm not sure why. I've given the people what they want. 
All right, looks like olive, yeah, olives are on their way, which mean olive oil will soon be on its way as well. Hygiene is deteriorating. Um, don't know why that would be. Oh, I might stick another infirmary there. Hygiene is no longer perfect, that's okay. Hygiene is excellent, but dropping. Uh, no, I think we should be okay. Um, we've got more people on the way. Migration is stable, so people are still coming. It's the unemployment that's an issue. Um, 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 let me think. If I built... I'm always going to need more storehouses. So this is a pretty safe bet. This can be my storage section. It's nice and close to the Agora. Uh, trying to think what else I could do with more of. I could build trading posts to all the other places. That would probably be quite a useful thing to have, even if I don't use them right now. So I'll build a trading post to Argos, Mount Pelion, and Caladon as well. Again, not the prettiest, but for someone who really loves... Oh god, now I need employees, are you kidding me? Alright, how's my employment looking? We need 14 workers, and we've got housing for 24 more people. Um, once the olive oil kicks in, that shouldn't be a problem. Um, I wonder, my popularity is still poor. We're making a lot of money now, so I'm going to drop the tax rate back to normal. Alright, so my popularity has gone up to okay. No unrest, finances are up, food level's good, hygiene's very good. We do need a lot more workers, but olive oil is now a thing. And I'm hoping... Ah, they respawn, we may have to keep an eye on that. But for now, this is okay. We just need those guys to move in, and they're on their way. Ah, we've got the rest of our wine, that's fantastic. So, Hercules... Come and join me. So Hercules is on his way. And when he's here, he'll kill off the Hydra. Actually, I'm going to throw a save in here because I'm a little bit worried. We'll call it Thebes. Why not? Alright, so I'm hoping that the olive oil man is going to go and grab his olive oil. Um, ah, he has. I saw him. But I'll get this guy to get olive oil just so that it's nice and, nice and close. So he hasn't got a lot. But we don't need a lot right now. This mean games begin. All right, so olive oil is now on the way. Fantastic. Now this is a townhouse. That's the biggest one you can get. You can't upgrade this anymore. Um, so they've got an extra room for eight more occupants and they've got everything that they need. That's pretty, pretty damn swish. I am very, very happy with that. Alright, so this is fantastic. Food is fine. We've got... Employment is soon going to be fine. Which is good, because we're going to need those extra workers. Once the Hydra's gone, we're going to need those extra workers to start building a marble press. And actually, since we've got the money, I'm going to build the roads for that now. Because I'm going to want it to link up with the rest of my city. Um, I think the only way you can do it is through here through here and then across the river so that's what we'll do we'll go um, where is the crossing there it is administration so we'll stick a water crossing there to clear some of this wood and what we're gonna do is we're gonna also want a water crossing yeah there's fine I guess um, clear a bit more of this wood and then we're gonna go through here gonna link it around like that and this is gonna come down here and it's gonna go through here I mean this isn't really an issue just yet because obviously the Hydra is still there but we might as well get the uh, get all this in there now and there's no reason not to yeah move through here around there around there now we'll just clear out a bit more of this wood so we've got nice easy access you don't need 
access directly to it, but I like to have it all linked up. It's just a personal preference. Um, all right, so that's all linked up now, so that's great. Um, and then what we are gonna need, there's no point building them yet because A, we don't have the workers yet, and also I'm worried if they go for it, they will just get slaughtered by the Hydra and it'll just be a waste of time. Um, but I think what I'll probably do is maybe save some of this for food, but I'll probably set up a nice marble and wood industry over here um, with some storehouses a bit closer to the town set to go and actually get the marble so it's nice and central. But our industry is sort of set apart. All right, that's an issue. I was hoping that they would get enough coverage. They clearly didn't, but we'll stick another maintenance guy there. Like I say, you never have too many maintenance guys unless you're massively uh, un uh, lacking in workers, but we're not, we're fine. And as this all upgrades, it's not gonna be an issue. Okay, so here's traders. We're not actually trading anything yet at the moment for most of these guys. Ah, there we go. There's these guys. Pleasure doing business with you. I hope Aeolus guides us home. Oh, he's a pleasant man, isn't he? And we've got enough. We got plenty of fleece for ourselves. And this is all upgrading massively. Food-wise, we're still fine. We've got food stored up for ten months. That's great. Um, yeah, I'm not worried at all at the moment. I'm a Hercules, and I'm ready for a challenge. What have you got? Okay. And here he is. This city is unsurpassed. Ah, thanks, Herc. All right, so he may be heading straight off. To, oh, that's going th straight through my bridge. Um, all right, no, so he's going to go to his hall and then he'll wander off and deal with the Hydra for us. So that's pretty sweet. He's getting caught up amongst the rabble. Sorry, I keep. I have a sort of nervous habit of pausing. A little more than I need to. Alright, good. We're still selling, so we're making plenty of dosh. Uh, we didn't win the Isthmian games. Uh, we've got a good chance to win all of them. You can also get excellent, but obviously you need a lot of... Uh... Oh, man. They look so much nicer in widescreen, and it also and also when they're upgraded, it just... Yeah, this is... This is great. So much less hassle. We need this guy to go and get the olive oil, really. What's his... No supply. Yeah, because this guy keeps getting to it first, and he doesn't come down here as much as I'd like him to. <clears throat> okay, so there is olive oil there. So we're doing fine for food. Where's Hercules gotten to? Has he reached his hall yet? Kind of lost track of him a bit. I don't know where Hercules has gone. He may already have head off, head, head off to uh, deal with the Hydra. Yeah, here he goes. Actually, now that he's doing that, I'm going to get my industry on the go. Yeah, we've got some unemployed again, so that's absolutely fine. So what I'm going to do is spread way out here. Stick a maintenance guy at the very end. And now what we need to do is produce loads of marble in one year um, so I'll make this guy, oh that guy's getting the olive oil so I'll make this guy accept nothing but marble actually no let's not make it this guy um, is there a way to reset this? I don't think there is All right. let's just have this guy accept everything except wheat, actually no you can accept wheat mm, no actually don't I think if the wheat goes to a storehouse you can sell it but I don't think the lady from the Agora will come and collect it, which would make it a bit useless. So we're not going to have them accept me. Let's have these two guys on the end. This one, only marble. And only marble. Actually physically go and get it. Now I'm hoping that once it exists, they will actually go and do that. But I don't know if it will be too distant for them, but we'll have to wait and see. Um, so that's going to be there. And then along here, literally all we're going to do is just have one, two, three, four. Oop. Undo that one. Four, five, six, 
six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, that may be overkill, and it almost definitely is, but we can sell marble to someone, I think. Yeah, we can sell marble to these guys, and it's worth quite a lot, so... If we have too much, that's not a problem at all. Alright, so Hercules will just finish off the Hydra. You've done something someone doesn't like very much. <laughs> Correct. Alright, so we need workers because we've just placed a load of stuff here. But that won't be a problem because we've got tons of people coming in. The Hydra is dead. Fantastic. The Hydra has been slain and your people are rejoicing. We can actually build monuments for things like this. So we've got a population monument. We've probably got a few of those that we can build. Um, we've also got a victory monument. It's not really much of a victory. It's the time that we... Uh, Actually, no, one of them will be for the Hydra, so I would count that as a victory, but the other one's from when we just bribed them, so they went away, so I, I wouldn't count that. Um, the Athlete Monument is from us winning the Olympic Games, and that increases appeal massively, but we haven't needed to use them yet, so I'm quite content to just save them.